Hello everybody, this is Altaren Ghost and welcome to Mainlining. This is a playable teaser for a game that is currently in development. The Kickstarter and the link to the game on Game Jolt will be in the description below. It's a point and click game where you play as an MI7 operative and you need to hack into suspects' devices to get evidence so that you can convict them. And it looks awesome. I don't know how long the playable teaser is, but I knew I needed to show everyone because it looks like a pretty cool game. And if you guys enjoy, I, I do suggest you go and back the Kickstarter. So let's go ahead and get this started. Oh, what is this, Windows XP? Let's go with the dog. I like the dog. Censorship data propaganda. MI7. Internal chat. Well, that wasn't the best way to start. I'll email you the report. Download it when you have a chance. Damn it, Wes is going to kill me. Why do I have to wait to read your daily case file to find out we've been breached? Hey everyone, thanks for welcoming me to MI7. So exciting! I'll be your new receptionist. Sorry I wasn't in to greet you this morning. I wanted to make an effort, but missed you altogether. Please find the new arrest guidelines attached. All agents must comply. It is essential that we deliver results. I trust you will follow every protocol and secure the longest sentences possible. Morning, everyone. Our hard drives have been wiped, so we're reinstalling everything from backup. Should start on your PC momentarily. Here's the case file. Let's download Admiral West's thing first. Arrest guide. The new wording for the three-tiered online arrest system is as followed. Selling prohibitive items, drugs, drug paraphernalia, contracts, stolen property, stolen data, stolen software. Sentence of five years in prison. Theft, data theft, identity theft, computer fraud, wire fraud, sentence of 15 years in prison. Software development, developing software unlicensed, developing malicious software, developing prohibited software, sentence of 25 years in prison. Whoa. This is going to be a fun organization to work for. Case file one. On 10-3-2010, MI7 suffered a serious data breach, resulting in the loss of all data not backed up. An investigation is in progress to determine how the perpetrator gained access and overcame the firewall. Our search from the guilty party is currently focused on FreedomWire.bp, an unindexed file-sharing website that appears to be engaged in illegal activity in several sectors. After gaining access to our system, an uninvited guest logged in using a known FreedomWire moderator account, MuscleBoy81. Discover the identity of the owner of the system, or, owner of the screen name, MuscleBoy81, and connect the guilty party to evidence linking them to another crime. The public must not be made aware that MI7 was subject to this breach. Keep your hat on. Applications should be should begin reinstalling momentarily. User account control. Oh, cool. Which user account do you want to use to run this program? I uh, can't click on anything else. Just me? Okay, I'll allow. Hey again. Maybe we should get a drink and have a proper chat sometime. Okay. What now? We need a real name and evidence of a fresh crime to initiate an arrest. Oh my god, dial up. Oh, fun times, right guys? Checking the site out now. FreedomWire.bp 
Can I not resize my screen? Because... Yeah, okay. This is annoying. I would, I would love to resize my screen, please. Welcome to Freedom Wire, the newest file sharing location. Between the five moderators on the site, we have 15 years of experience. We never leave our bedrooms slash PCs. MI7 can't stop us. Ooh. Shrekcraft 2, Heart of the Boogaloo, probably is what that says. The Wachowski's ASCII, Dream.exe, Game of Tomes, Season 4, Episode 8, Generic Superhero Film. Can I not? Open any of these? You should have most of your software back now. Oh, can I change this? Let's see. Oh, full screen. Well, I guess that's it. Turn the music down a smidge. Make sure it's not too loud. Which user account do you want to run? Mainlighting.exe. Just make sure there's nothing else in here. No. Okay. The lookup software and mainline are reinstalled. You have everything at your disposal to apprehend the troll who gatecrashed my kingdom. Yours faithfully, the IT guy. <laughs> Can anyone explain why we don't have a mainline direct into this site yet? Just found out about it myself. Can't say I've ever been in the market for, well, you know. I don't, and I don't want to. Can you just get rid of this Mr. Muscle Boy 81 please? Swap his steroids with barbiturates if you have to. You will need three pieces of information to arrest suspect. Name, location, evidence. When choosing a suspect's location, it has to be the district they're in at the time of arrest. This may be their workplace or home. Evidence is imported from your documents folder. Make sure you download the file you need. You can only use one piece of evidence, which will need to prove the suspect guilty of a particular crime. Okay. So... Let's see how to do this. Yes, okay, help, yep, okay, IP hack. Oh, yeah, if it was only that easy, guys. Hack into a computer using IP, ping a website to find the IP, switch to switch login user. Sure, let's uh let's ping oh, what's that again? Freedomwire dot bp. Oh I think they know I did it. Hello Mr. Green, I see you're trying to access my machine. Say hello to my friend Mr. Red. Oh, he took me offline. Oh, you little ass. Looks like our suspect disconnected us. I'll disconnect his head from his hormonally imbalanced body. <laughs> it says the reset password should be on our desktop somewhere. Why are they always moving stuff? Uh, where's my coffee? <laughs> Let's look at our desktop then. Uh, censorship data propaganda. Oh, whoa! Look at that. The recycle bin has some stuff in it. He must be guarding the network. If you still have mainline open, note the IP so he doesn't see us coming again. I got that. Uh, can I can I make notes? Oh, I can. Oh, that's awesome. Cool. Okay, so let's keep that and let's see what's in here. Uh, act basic. Okay, so help bring up help. Okay.
When hacking, you will access many different areas of your computer and those of other users. Try to keep track of where you are. Wherever you are, you can return to localhost, your PC, by entering R or get help by pressing H. To reset your network, click on the network icon at the bottom right of your desktop. Oh, here we go. Oh, okay, look at that. Back online. Find a name and any evidence linking Muscle Boy 81 to anything illegal. Anything. So let's see then. IP hack. No, wait. I think it's. Put them away for as long as you can. Quickly. 232-847-864-43 hack. What? Oh, do I have to type IP hack? Oh, okay, there we go. 232-847-864-43. Logged in to freedomwire.freedomwire. Hello, freedomwire. Read the contents of a file list. Type ideas. Rework ratings. 10 star system. Let users post feedback. Remove ads. Okay. Type. Actually, you know what? Let's, uh. Download. Mod names. Just in case I get disconnected or anything. Of course. Unknown, unknown, and a fake name. Okay, let's see what we downloaded. Mod names. 420 Kid. Adam Sun. Freak No Leash. Peter Farbs. Muscle Boy Ryan Bell. Ooh, look at that. Okay, so we have that now. Can we find this guy? Which one was it? This one, I think? Yeah. By last name it is. Okay, so Bell. Ryan. Yeah, Ryan Bell. Resident Kings. He's a blogger. Mail. Okay, but I need something tying him besides just saying that that's his username. Ooh, software dev. Wait, is this actually him? Hold on. Yeah, sold by Muscle Boy. Okay. Because that's the maximum. Getting him as a software dev. Let's minimize this stuff. Ah, I got an email. Thank you for your order. We'll let you know once your items have been dispatched. Attach is a receipt con confirming your order. Sold by Muscle Boy. Software development. Return to order summary. Is that receipt enough? I already bought it. I don't know what that is. Thank you for our order, attached as a receipt.
It says to view the status of your order, return to order summary. Okay, so I ordered something from him and I got a receipt. I mean, is that enough to to get him? Let's find out. Okay, so let's see. Residents and kings. Oh, I saw you somewhere. Thought I saw you somewhere. Oh, yeah, I did. Okay. Evidence would be order dev. Order confirmed. Arrest. Oh, wow. Huh, it worked. Okay, so I was just looking looking around the computer and trying to find other things to do, and I'd already solved the case. Blogger sentenced to 25 years for data misuse. A suspect has been arrested in connection with cybercrime by the newly reinstated MI7, an official has stated. At 1841 today, Ryan Bell, aka MuscleBoy81, was arrested by authorities after hacking into highly confidential information. The 29-year-old arrested in Kings was convicted for unlicensed software development and sentenced to 25 years in prison. He pleaded guilty to his crimes. Other news. Has the Blue Pill Act gone too far? We ask those who are fighting it. This guy just bought something from Grand Trunk. You will never guess what happened next. Are drugs pouring into Ocean Beach? <laughs> oh, that was, that was really fun. I was making it far more difficult than it needed to be. So I was, I was looking around because I thought maybe I needed something else, because that seemed a little too easy. But I imagine as the game goes on, it gets more difficult. Uh, they had mentioned sometimes you have to arrest them where they work, not where they live. So I'd have to look out for that, because it says you need to arrest them where they're currently located. So if they're at work when I arrest them, I need to make sure I do that. So all in all, it looks like it's going to be a really, really fun game. And I suggest uh, you guys at least play the playable teaser, see if you guys like it. Uh, there is a Kickstarter, there's a Steam green light. Well, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, please give it a like, and I will see you guys in the next video. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey. I'm just gonna close the door on my fire. <laughs>